Welcome everyone Wait. to Pixelmon Revolution Season One. Woo. All right, so we're here to join with jump, a bunch of jump people. Up <laughs> jump, yeah, jump up and down. Make sure that we're we're all still here, not frozen or whatever. Yeah, okay, we're good. <laughs> uh, all right, so welcome everybody. Uh, we're gonna be having some fun here oh, playing some Pixelmon wingle. this season. Uh, <laughs> that's the shiny wingle. Totally is. There goes the there shiny wingle. <laughs> Watch it and wave goodbye. Goodbye, shiny wingle. Goodbye. Wait, oh, oh my God. God. Jesus. <laughs> we are truly blessed. We are joined here with a bunch of uh, a bunch of people. We got like thirty some people. Not everybody is actually here on the server. Alyssa, I'm sure we'll be back in just a second. Uh, so yeah, uh, basically we're just going to be working building a region here. We have uh, just small towns, NPC towns, and that's it. It's up to us to actually build the cities and towns here to make this place come together. Um, I think that's about it, really. Everyone just have fun, enjoy yourself, and uh, let's let's start a really great season. You're not Thank you like so much, Casey, for getting for getting this together. You're not going like, to like intro all of us. Here's nope. everybody. Thanks to, press to major thanks to Bayfish. Big thanks to Bayfish yep. for throwing this all together. Gonna have to go find an area outside of spawn. And maybe Chase have to have shiny wingle. Anyone got a ball or something we can catch that with? Grizzer does. <laughs> the heck away. Caldeo. Right, Caldeo is a town. I'm gonna start making food for everybody. Caldeo, right, oh my god. Anyone? Anyone want it? Anyone want a battle with Caldeo? I love Caldeo. Caleb, where'd you go? I'm at the village. Yeah, we're in the village. Oh, I see. Oh, hey, there's a very fancy hey, unicorn guys, in the river. Chickens. Yep, that's the Kalita. Wait, you uh, found okay. chickens? Oh, uh, yeah. yeah like, I, it's a master I, ball? Yeah, why not? No, a GS ball. Nice. nice. Oh, geez. That'll be, fun. that'll be nice. <laughs> oh, go, <laughs> into, go into battle with it and then catch it. Okay. Oh, God, chunk air. I, I found a village. It's a nice village. It's got everything. Oh, There's a gym over there. That's a gym in the middle of the water. Cool. <gasps> oh. Yeah, I think, I think you're over by the mangrove. Oh my gosh. That's that was so close. He got three shakes on the Keldeo. I'm going to fight you. <laughs> Chicken, use peck. Hee <laughs> <laughs> hee. Level seven. You know? Oh, mm -hmm. Geodude. Let's take it on. Leafage. No crashes. Our server is performing very well. And we have 20 people on it. Damn. Oh, I am level 7 now. <laughs> the invisible loots, they have like this particle effect giving off, but doesn't you see it right here? Oh, yeah. What'd you, oh, you got a TM? What is it? I see wind. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, I see a lot of apricorn trees up here. There's a uh, apricorn tree directly oh, to I your see. right. You see it? Yeah, I see it. Okay. One here. Pink. Why am I only finding pink, black, and yellow? I had red. Oh, this one's blue. Oh, that's good. Quick balls, great balls. Blue and yellow, we can make quick balls, so those are really good. Hello. Hello. Oh. I have a business proposition for Rocket Inc. Uh hmm. Mm -hmm. hmm. It's when you type that, we're all like, hmm, hmm. hmm. <laughs> Nobody <laughs> answered. We were just like, hmm. <laughs> we got a hmm at this for a good 30 minutes. <laughs> yeah, that's how we operate. Hmm. I propose, so what's the proposition? I, I propose that um, any building you need done for special projects, you outsource to Dash Incorporated. We'll handle oh, all you your. Just made a mistake, man. I know. <laughs> well, I, I know. I know. I know. Zobie's a builder, but you know what? I'm better. No, no, we. The project that we have is insane. No, I know it is. Um, I know. That's why I'm approaching you about it. I know the giant but, uh, on the ground. No, uh, yeah, you know <laughs> that's not. Him. Oh yeah, I mean, uh, no, the non. Uh, the, you're the, the, you're only scratching the surface. The the mall. that was that was a rumored thing back in the Team Rocket days that uh, uh, doesn't uh, really exist anymore, really uh, <laughs> officially. Understood. Uh, um, the. Uh, uh, <laughs> but I think one place that we could really use is a good old skyscraper at spawn uh, to. Say oh, okay. hey, here's our here's our uh, legitimate, respectable business. Right, and there'll, there'll be no right. secret bunker underneath or anything. No, nope, definitely won't be. Not at first. Okay. <laughs> they, uh, but, but if it is, the very idea. But if it is, Dash Inc is a very discreet company. Discreet. So, so you discreet know, company. So, yes, you know, we'll make note of that. Yeah. So mm. so any you know any records can be shredded as needed. So. Hmm. Yes. That's good but to know. It's, it's, sometimes you have to be why, careful. Why would, with your a, why would you shred a music disc? Well, we'll definitely keep this in mind as we progress. 
through our world dominate i mean through our global uh, marketing and adventures yes of course okay well it was nice talking to <laughs> every one of you and uh, yes, i, I yes. wish you good fortune with your company mm. yes we will be in contact soon hmm, yes. <laughs> <laughs> goodbye <laughs> Bye. Go back to where you were 20 seconds ago. I see your name tag. Come down the hill. Hi. Oh. Uh, 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 uh. Did you get kicked too? Yeah. Oh no. Uh oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So does he have a move called Payday? Can you check his stats? Uh, let me see. I think I have. If you I I hit E, moves. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, uh, I fell in a hole. Ow. Fake out, growl, faint, and scratch. Okay, so he doesn't have Payday yet, but Payday, when he learns it, you can just fight mm -hmm. any... If you fight wild Pokemon, you use Payday, it'll pay you money, even though it's not a trainer. Oh. Yeah, so that's how we're going to be getting money, pretty much. <laughs> so, fight with Meowth for yeah. Paydays. Oh, yeah, 100%. I thought, you, I thought you were saying, like, Payday is, and, like, catch this thing, sell it, and you'll get money. I'm going to go cut down some trees. If anyone finds the blue wood or the red wood, like the cherry or the magic, whatever, I really need it. I am currently <gasps> in the magic. What, what yeah, the, can I you, need cherry. Can you tell me the chords to that? I'm currently in the magic. Seriously, <laughs> sounds like Nebris. He sounds like Nebris every time I hear you talk. <laughs> Shut up! I do not sound yes. like Nebris. Oh if your God. voice was a little bit more raspy, yeah. it would sound a just, little bit just more just like Nebris. Just go smoke like 100 packs of cigarettes real quick, and then you'll Damn be it. good. Not suggested. Stop. Stop Don't worry you. about it. <laughs> ah, bro. There you go. Oh. You know, that is a very good question. Daisy, why do the Pokemon all want to drown themselves in Ediopolis? No, want to know what's even even more concerning question? Why does every... Is anyone here PG? No. Okay, why does every Pokemon want to fuck Ditto? Have you seen it? <laughs> because it could turn into other versions Because of it's just a giant and... fleshlight, dude. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> you know what? It can turn into your fan. Look at those eyes, though. Oh, my God. Whoa, I'm PG, fellas. I not. mean, you're kind oh. of <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course, um, you were 100% PG there, Peanut. I'm always PG. 100%. Yeah, you so were the most PG so person I have ever totally met. Wasn't. I'm gonna oh, see. I, I wonder. I don't know yeah. when he gets payday. It don't matter. I'm gonna just. I'm gonna mess this bird thingy up. Maybe, I maybe in the team. I, some some of them might not even learn it. I thought maybe. I don't know. Let me see. I'm checking. No, I, it's it's gotta be in like the teens, isn't it? About to eat myself oh. cave root. Hey, hey, level 12. Get into level 12 and you're going to be rich, and I hate you. All right, cool. Oh, a Woobat <laughs> is a level on fire. Level now. Level oh. Yep, found the cherry biome. But I won't. Like, we're mad is at that? already? No, Jesus. The, the cherry blossom grove. All the pink trees. Oh, yeah, no, I need some of them for decorating I'll, my I'll, area. I'll, it's I'll not bring... even just for the wood. It's for, like, just the saplings. Yeah, I... The sapling. <laughs> Yeah, no, so I can grow the trees, like, because uh, that's all I need, is I just need the trees to grow. Like, I don't need the actual, like, wood for building. I need it for decoration. Mm. Yeah, yeah, I, I want the I want, I want the leaves for decoration, and I want the wood. Um, so I'll bring you a sapling, maybe? But I don't have an axe, so I gotta make a furnace. Oh, yeah, this Ooh. is definitely gonna be my new area. Okay, I'm gonna have to step away for a second. All right. Oh, got an Ampharos. Finally, Dartrix is evolving. We got a Decidueye. Nice. Spirit Shackle. Oh yeah, you can fly. Been waiting for this. I'm gonna help you out some more. Line them up. You ready? Yep. Send it. Yeah, I'll throw it out and then you throw your Pokemon at mine and it should just like a like yeah, there you go. There you we hit, go. Okay. Here, battle rules, hit battle rules. We're gonna make it fair. Battle rule. Level cap okay. one hundred, raise the cap on so all our Pokemon are equal level. And then you have to accept it. Alright, and then you just you have to like click your guys. Level oh we we're we yeah. are level one hundred, okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It, I was like, whoa. <laughs> yeah, we just raise it to the cap, and then it, it goes back to normal after the battle. Yeah.
I'm dark type and normal type. So if you have any I'm, uh, fighting type. I'm meowths, meowths and a bird. <laughs> oh god, I hit you with that payday, son. I got an Obstagoon band and I'm just I'm home clawsing on the sweep. How many home claws do you think I need? Two or three? Mm. I'm going Probably. Longer. Probably only need three. Nah, I'm doing three. Uh, Obstagoon's a pretty strong hitter, but Yeah, this I mean, one this one's nature is minus attack, so it's <laughs> I still only need three. Yeah. Watch this. If this hits, it's gonna kill your mouth in one hit. Uh, it didn't hit. Oh, okay. uh, get wrecked. Oh, it did. <laughs> oh, there it went. Just about. This my reap is annoying. Marie. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> oh, nice. Okay. GG. You swept. We swept with Obstagoon. Let me guess, if, if I would have fought you without being level 100, so I might have had a chance. Well, Unless it's probably he was, higher level. He was level 35. So. I mean, I don't know. I think we were still around the same level, but I was trying to make it, like, yeah. fair. I get you. Appreciate you. Here, here I, can, I can give you a gift. Here, you can sell this. Uh, uh, you left. I'm coming. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm coming back. You can sell that. Here, do you heal your boys up? Do you heal your boys up? Yeah, I already healed them up. Alright, cool. Alright, guys, so after a little bit of Abra catching, uh, Dash decided that he was going to help me out and come out and hunt Abra. Well, not necessarily help me out, but also also hunt Abras. So I managed to get two jolly uh, synchronized Abras. So I've got one uh, that's docile with inner focus, and then I've got two that are jolly synchronized. And he got one. Which one is yours? It has the gentle synchronized gentle synchronized so i don't need two jollies and he doesn't want a gentle but because i'm going for one of each exact type uh we decided to make a trainer a trainer a trader and uh he's gonna give me his uh gentle for my jolly i don't know where in here we should put this because it's like too big to put right here isn't it it's four wide i think is it four wide three wide perfect three wide there we go sure all right, so let me uh, let me check these guys. Man, I hope, they are... I hope well, we can't check IVs yet, but I hope I get the one with better IVs. I mean, I'm I'm I plan on just breeding them anyway. Yeah. Hang on, let me. Yeah, that's the right one. If not, we can just trade again. Yeah. All right. Did that? It was Jolly that it. Synchronized. Yep. Thank you. I need. All right, I got the and I got the gentle synchronized. Nice. Yay! Thank Sweet. you. Uh, I guess now back to catching more abras between the two of us, and we'll probably end up just trading off on a whole <laughs> yeah. bunch of. Them. Yeah, I only have two, so I gotta I gotta get a bunch. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed all of those clips. I know it's been pretty hectic. Um, I just edited them all together, and it looks like we're a little bit over halfway through our episode. So. To end off, what I want to do is I want to try and get a basic plot for our area down. And I know we haven't even went through this, but this is our area. Um, it's kind of in this very nice valley area. Uh, most of our actual, uh, our personal base is going to be back there. We're going to build the gym somewhere around here and build it up and connect into like the cliffs. And then most of the town is going to be in this plains biome that outstretches this way. Um... We have caught a few things that, I, unfortunately, I did not get on camera. Yeah, so most of the time will be right out here in this area, coming up to this river. Um, so I want to kind of plot it out. We got a few things um, that I want to talk about. So first things first is our starter was uh, uh, Rallet, and we've got a Decidueye to fly on now. I've gotten an Excadrill, and he's been uh, very good, very fun. I've always loved this Pokemon. We got an Ampharos just... For now, because it can use Thunder Wave and it has helped catch so many Pokemon. 
um, including this guy, this guy, and we got this legendary. This is a super rare legendary spawn because it is in Sunflower Plains, which is a very small biome, and it's only at, I think, Dusk or Dawn, or Dusk and Dawn. Um, but yeah, we got a Cosmog, so now we're going to level him up, get a Solgaleo or a Lunala, whichever one, not sure yet. So that's going to be, uh, you know, a ton of fun. And then we can open portals to the Ultra Space Dimension uh, whenever we want, I believe. Uh, so we're going to work on leveling him up. I've got a Lucky Egg on him. I actually have a Ghost DMZ on Decidueye. I need to put up the Sharp Beak that we had. Yeah, put stuff like that in here. Um, you know, we've got enchant set up, so we've, we've been working on a lot of stuff. I've got cherry wood right here because, uh, the red wood will look good for our Pokemart. This blue wood will look good. I mean, Poke Center, the blue wood will look good for the Pokemart. And uh, we've got some crops here, a ton of Apricorns. Uh, we got this auto mechanical anvil going. It is super loud. Listen to this. That's awful. That's seriously awful. Uh, we have some mods in here like iron furnaces, iron chests, so a little bit uh, extra stuff. We've got chisel in this mod pack, um, meaning we've got, you know, a ton of extra blocks. Watch this. Look at all these blocks. Eight pages of extra blocks. Uh, we're all, we also have quark, which is pretty much the same thing, you know, another page of blocks. So, We've got a lot of building options. I think we've come up with a, a really good palette for our area. And our area is going to be a fighting town like Dojo. So most people, uh, Grimer, the, our founder here, wants us to build like towns and have like gyms and stuff in them. Uh, so slowly we have a full region and we connect them all up. Oh, that's a manetric. Um, so I'm making a fighting town. Uh, our good friend Mac Attack, um, everyone's links and stuff will be in the description, including uh, Max. Um, she is going to do a music style gym, probably here close by that way. So, uh, we're going to do a fighting gym. Uh, I'm thinking about, you know, Lucario, Infernape is definitely one. Uh, I want to get on there. Uh, Como-O, which is like a pseudo legendary. Uh, and then I'm kind of open to suggestion for everybody else. I was thinking Conkelder, maybe Breloom, maybe Halucha. Those are all, uh, some ones I've been playing around with. Uh, Pangoro, because it's got dark typing as well to help cover... Um, you know, the psychic weakness, you know, just a lot of options for how we could go with this gym. So, uh, we are going to work and I'm going to try and lay out, uh, our town a little bit. I'm going to clean up this area and then we'll be back and we will probably start on building our Poke Center somewhere in here, uh, together. So, uh, I will see you guys when I've got all this area cleaned up. We've got a Mega Amphros here and if we get it, we get... I think I think we'll get a mega stone or something like that. So let me switch out Cosmog really quick for someone for like Keldeo, I guess. I don't know. I don't think this guy can get Thunder Waved. So I'm gonna start out with him. Yeah. Okay. Not not bad. You can get some digs. I don't even know what this was that even super effective or is rock super effective? Let me see. I gotta, I gotta pay close attention. Dig. Okay, so Dig is. I feel like Dig's gonna be our best, our best bet. And if he doesn't have anything that can hit me, then that'd be insane. But I seriously doubt that it's gonna go, gonna be like that. Discharge, Thunder Shock. Neither of those can hit me. He's got something that raises Cotton Guard. Yeah. I honestly, this guy may not be able to hit me. got it wow okay we killed a mega amphro let's see what we get i got amphrosite i got a plate let's drop that and oh which one do we want i think i'll just go for the bracelet wait what happened did i not get it i don't think i got it uh oh i might have messed that up i clicked i clicked on the mega bracelet Let's see if I can mega evolve this guy. Oh, maybe. Okay, we can. Okay, I'll figure it out. Um, yeah, so I cleared out the trees, as you guys can see. This is a big mill tank. Um, but now I gotta clear out all these apricorns. Uh, still got a little bit of work to do, but I just saw that, and I was like, yes, we gotta get this. So, alright, back to work.
All right, guys, I've been doing quite a bit of work. Uh, let me just heal my pokes up really quickly so I can give you a good aerial view of what we've been doing. Um, I didn't get the full layout done, just kind of more like the opening entrance to our area uh, way over there. We still have all this area that's empty, but most of this is probably going to be taken up by this large structure I've got planned, like in my head. I haven't actually planned it out. Um, so the sand is going to be like river. So it's going to flow down from here, and I, th I want it to flow down somewhere from here. Um, come into this and make like a circle. We'll have a garden here in the middle um, with this cobblestone pathway all the way around and one going right through it. This platform, I want to have the nether portal on. Um, so when people come in, they're like right here. Uh, I want to have it nice built up, like a, like a nice design with it. Um, these are like buildings. Uh, here as well, and this is going to be our Pokey Center, which we are going to build right now. Uh, at least the this like front facade of it we want to build right now. We're probably not going to get to the interior today, um, but I wanted to do a little bit of building because he, you guys know me. If you've seen any of my videos, we we really like to build uh, here on the on the channel. So uh, we're gonna do a little bit of this building together. Let's run. Okay. Uh, we got quite a few people on. It is currently 3.30 a.m. in the morning, and we still have six people on the server. I mean, all day today, this is the second day now, all day today we had like somewhere between 10, 8, and 12 people probably on the server. So, yeah, it's been it's been crazy. So, I want to go up 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. This is kind of hard. I'm just going to block it out with stone at first. Just like that will be the shape and we get another uh log right here one um i've got um ebony wood and fir wood ebony wood we're going to use for s some of the buildings later on um but look at this look how similar they are what we like about ebony wood is the planks the planks are beautiful but this wood is really not abundant and this wood is so we got to save as much as we can so we use fir wood for the logs and uh it looks very nice it's kind of like acacia, but it's not as desaturated, so it's a very pretty wood block. Sorry, I'm trying to shape out. We've got like a stone foundation to this build. It's like stone and stone brick foundation to this build. So it's a little bit confusing uh, to see everything that's going on. We'll randomize it just like this, and we will mix in our stone brick, stone and polished andesite all throughout here. Uh, I'm gonna do just a little bit more work uh, here guys um, on this foundation and we'll come back we'll work on uh, the upper section a little bit all right I've done a little bit of work on the base um, and I wanted to show you guys this block this is brownstone we're gonna be using this um, for the backdrop what we want to do now is go up here and all of these uh, yeah we want to fill all this with brownstone pretty much and uh, we have block craftery in this so I can take this, and I can fill it with brownstone just like that and we'll turn a couple of these into the tile version just to add a little bit of like difference just like that and then of course we'll have our door there and then let's do the same thing here so now uh, this is gonna be our Pokemart we can put some right here uh, but I can do it later we need to get our wood and we're gonna be using cherry wood for this Okay, so here we've got cherry wood. It's a beautiful block, like seriously gorgeous block. Let's put away a, t a lot of this other stuff because we don't need it anymore. Seriously, probably the most beautiful wood uh, I've seen in this game yet. And it's really unfortunate I can't use it for this entire area. I would love to, it just, I need to be able to tell the Pokey Center apart from everything else. Okay, I think a good place to start would be right here. We have a slab right there, so. From here, let's get on top of this. Stair, stair, full block. Stair, stair, full block. And then that's whenever we slab down from here. Yeah, so I think I've got stairs going all the way around us. So let's do it just like so. We will wrap it around right here. And we can bring this all the way into the mountain. And we won't do anything special with it, really. Um, so let's do this other side real quick. Actually, I can't do the other side because I didn't finish it. Uh, so I will finish up the top right here. Let's take a look. Yeah, not looking too shabby. That's a really good shape for the, for like a, you know, a base. But just wait. It, it really comes alive in the, the detail phase and the next step. So I will show you guys how we do that. Uh, let me just finish up this basic structure. 
and uh, we'll come back and finish the build up. All right, guys, I'm pretty sure this is it. I, I think I'm ready to call this complete for today's episode. We've got everything in. We've got our nice little flyer boxes. We've got iron bars here. I switched it out for coarse dirt. We've got uh, the panes. We got lighting behind it. We got you know our insignia for the mart. I'm I'm pretty sure we're we're done for the day. I'm really enjoying this build. I really like this style. Um, we might maybe down the line switch the uh this backing out for dark prismarine, um because it is a seriously beautiful block and it looks beautiful with this palette. I've tested it out in a creative world, um. But that is impossible to get, uh, or impossible to farm at least in this. Um, so we might get a trader eventually that lets us buy it. Um, but for now, we will use this. It looks very nice. It doesn't make anything pop too bad. Um, well, it lets the red pop. It serves as a background. So really like it. Really happy with this. Really happy with everything we did Pixelmon wise in today's episode. We got uh, a bunch of good guys. And real quick, I think I never got to really show you guys, but we're also farming. Uh, these are just like some random guys we got. We're also farming Jangma O's uh, until we get the right nature. I got Drillbers until I got this guy's got the right nature, but I don't know their IVs. The IV command is not working. Um, Riolu's, uh, Chimchars, and Infernapes because we need all of those for our gym. Or we need the Riolu, the Chimchar, and the Jangma O for our gym. I just really like Excadrill, but we should have we should have him sorted by now. Um, but yeah, it's just a facade right now. We don't have the. Uh, interior finished of this build um but hopefully you know by the time next episode starts or is at least over this will probably be more complete uh with an interior and such so uh that's all i got for this episode uh, i hope you guys enjoyed uh this is your first episode on my channel please let me know what you thought of it uh how you like the format we're probably going to be doing this series formatted different than kingdom of dash if you're a long time viewer so Kingdom of Dash, we like to do a lot of time lapses. Not going to do that much here. Going to be more montages and uh, progress updates and just, you know, general multiplayer shenanigans like the first half of this episode. That was a ton of fun. Um, and it wasn't too hard to put together. It just took a, a, an hour or so. So uh, my name is Dash. I hope you enjoyed the episode. And as always, thanks for watching.